Right, uh, 3.1e periodic phenomena, quick review based on NFRQ. Uh, the figure shows a merry-go-round on a level ground with fence to its right. The merry-go-round rotates in counterclockwise direction, completes one rotation every three seconds. So three seconds is the period. B is on the edge of the merry-go-round. This is over here and it's located at the furthest, uh, furthest part of the may go round from the fence at time t equal to zero right and uh, point b is four feet from the center of the merry go round as well so this is four feet right this one is four feet okay the center of the merry go round is 10 feet from the fence so this is 10 feet over here now they are asking that if it moves if it moves at a constant speed then the distance of b from the fence is measured as a function of time again we have the find uh, five points and we need to find the coordinates of these points um i think at time t equal to zero it is at the maximum distance right and the maximum distance will be 10 plus 4 of course because 10 is still here and 4 is this much so it will be 14 so I think we are talking about f. f is clearly 0, 14 then because it can definitely start from t equal to 0. That's where it is. Uh, and its period is 3 seconds. And what is the what is 3 divided by 4? Because that's where it will change from maximum to the midline. 3 over 4 is 0 0.75. Uh, so uh, this will become from 0, it will become 0 0.75 comma and uh, what will be the height uh, the height will be 10 feet because that will be right at the middle so this will be comma 10 or maybe i can write it separately as well so f is 0 comma 14 g is 0 0.75 comma 10 and j will be again 0 0.75 so 1.5 comma and the minimum distance when b comes here will be 10 and minus 4 only this one right this is what we are looking for to so 10 minus 4 is 6 and once again k will be at the same distance which is 2.25 comma 10 same as g and p will be at 3 comma 14 same as f and they're asking to analyze between f and g in this case so f and g is over here F and G is clearly positive, nothing is going negative, but it is decreasing as well. So positive and decreasing will be like this, option B. And what is the ROC? Clearly between F and G, it is uh, concave down. So concave down means ROC is decreasing over here. 